Hey there, how are you doing? Having Android smartphone and having difficulties to hear sound from your videos? Well, we've got you covered. Let's go ahead and fix that. Hello guys and girls, it's your guy Michael from the Recovery team and I'm back with more practical data solutions and for anything around recovering data, fixing corrupted videos and files, you better subscribe to the channel for more interesting videos to follow. Now, today's topic is pretty interesting and I think it has been affecting a lot of us. You're having a good Android smartphone and a lot of videos there, however, you can't hear any audio. And we have a few solutions for you in order how to fix that condition, but first let's discuss about the possible reasons of why this happens. Generally, when it comes to video playback, and that would mostly concern streaming online videos, I can think of three major reasons. Well, first and most apparent could be that your operating system is outdated. Secondly, it could be a network coverage issue. And thirdly, very trivial, but indeed the video that you're trying to watch could be damaged. When it comes to playback of locally stored video files, the situation might be a little different. Well, first, we might check our video player because very often the issues are caused by corrupted or outdated video player. Secondly, it could be down to the cache of this media player. And thirdly, we've already made a video about how to fix that, could be a codec issue. So now that we know what could trigger a sound issue on Android, let's figure out what we can do in order to fix these conditions. And the first and most basic troubleshooting procedure to make a reboot. To do that, simply press and hold the power button and choose restart. Once the device is restarted, check if it can now play the sound from a video or not. If not, we're moving forward to the next solution. Android devices come with a dedicated Do Not Disturb feature, which is going to put your smartphone in the silent mode for a selected duration. This simply means that if DND is activated, your device will not play any sound or whatsoever, and you won't be able to watch your favorite videos with sound. In this case, simply swipe down to bring the notification tray and disable Do Not Disturb. Now go back to the media player, check if your videos are playing sound. If you're still not hearing sound from your video on your smartphone, swipe down to bring the notification tray again and make sure that there aren't any connected wireless speakers or headphones. Because very often your phone gets connected to a wireless audio output and if that's the case it's normal that the smartphone speaker is not reproducing any sound. So, in order to bring back the sound to your smartphone, make sure to disconnect any Bluetooth devices which could seem like a speaker or headphones. As I mentioned earlier in the video, an outdated version of Android could also trigger a similar problem, so make sure to update your device to the latest possible version of the OS so that you don't encounter such errors. To check for updates, go to Settings, About Device, Android Version, check for updates, but keep in mind that certain smartphone vendors are hiding the Updates option into another place in the Settings. In case an update doesn't help, it's quite possible that there is some problem with your current media player. In general, if you try to play an incompatible video file with Android's default media player, it's most likely going to cause some issues. In such a situation, simply go to Play Store, install a different media player, and I'm showing you how to do that with VLC. So far so good! I think we saw a few very easy to follow examples of how we can fix this condition if the problem is software related. But like every complex situation, now, the problem could be on one side software related, on the other side it could be a hardware related issue. Therefore, you, know, you might have to visit a service center. Now, good news, if your smartphone is still under warranty, make sure to check with your vendor because who knows, maybe they can fix it for you for free. Good. Now, following the logic of excluding the possible causes, uh, we already checked the possible software issues, we checked the possible hardware issues. So, if you're trying to play back audio from your video and it still doesn't work, most likely the reason is a corrupted video file. And I'll tell you about how we can easily fix and repair corrupted video files where apparently the audio won't be working fine. First of all, we begin with the installation. Now, we launch the software, we click Add in order to load a damaged video file and since Repair It supports batch processing, you can even add multiple videos at the same time. 
Once the videos are successfully added, click the repair button at the bottom right corner. This will initiate the repairing process. Wait for a couple of minutes as this process might take a while to complete. Now, click the preview button in order to check if the videos are fixed and then click save all in order to export them to your computer. And that's how quick and convenient it is to repair damaged videos using Wondershare Repair It. No easy way to fix the audio from a video file on Android? No, 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 not you, because you already know the possible reasons and the possible solutions, and I think they're pretty easy to follow. And on top of that, if the issue is caused by a corrupted video file, our new version of Repair It has you covered. So simple and easy to use. And I truly hope that this episode has helped you to fix those sound issues on your smartphone and now you can play that back through your headset, through your smartphone speakers or, you know, home um, cinema system or whatever you're using to play back videos. And that's been it for today's episode. If you have any questions, comments or probably you want to share a happy recovery story, use the comment section below. For more information, check on the description. Make sure to be subscribed because there are a lot of useful videos on the pipeline. I'm Michael and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye!